Welcome back, everybody, or welcome us back. We missed you guys. Last week, we were down in Southern California, LA area. We had Q&A for hours and hours. That was the big thing. Everybody enjoyed it. I got some good feedback over the past week, and uh, we had a nice time. Don't ever miss the traffic. I don't like the traffic when we go down there, but it's good to see the saints in the flesh, so that's always nice. We're going to do something. Ryan and I had an idea. The last book that we're going to do verse by verse of Paul's epistles is 2 Corinthians. That's the one we're normally in on Sundays here. But until then, because we don't have the Wednesday nights, I'm going to be alternating. So as you can see, we're going to be in Matthew chapter 3 today. We're going to start there, and I'm going to deal with questions that I get about the prophetic program. So let me go ahead and uh, get, get us started. Today is Sunday, the 17th of March, 2019. This is a question that I had about the kingdom of God versus the kingdom of heaven, okay? And I, I get this every once in a while, so it's good to kind of refresh and renew the understanding about why sometimes it's mentioned as the kingdom of God in scripture and other times the kingdom of heaven. And we're going to start in Matthew chapter 3. A couple of announcements before we do. Pray. We always want to start our day off, especially in public worship, thanking the Lord for his marvelous grace. Pray for your brothers and sisters in Christ. We have some saints out. Be in prayer for Toby and Michelle. Michelle heard her back. He said she stepped in a hole or something at the park, so she strained her back. You know how that is. So I, they prayed uh, that they could be here next week. Toby said uh, that's when Krista's parents are going to be here. So we want everybody to be here to say hi to John and Diane. Uh, visiting from Minnesota. So that's next Sunday. Larry and Rosie, Larry's on his way, he just texted me, but we met with them before we left and they came over to our apartment and they want to be more active in ministry. So uh, they both decided that they could help out as, as events coordinators. And what, if you have any ideas or thoughts, you can contact Larry and Rosie directly. When you see them here, or they should be in the uh, directory that Dodie makes. But they want to do that so we can have different events like we had that Friday. And uh, they want to do that. Plus, they're going to be dealing with the children a lot as well. They're very good with, with children. So we thank God for Larry and Rosie. When they came over, they had been with us one year as of March the 4th. So March 4th, a couple weeks back, there was their one-year anniversary here at the assembly. So we thank God for that. We'll have our regular Q&A. And written offering, those who want to give back, you can always pray for us and give. 